So all of those uh, capacitive and voltage curves and behavior that we looked at was for the ideal case. So now let's look at what happens in the non-ideal case. And we'll first look at inversion. Okay, so again, here's our MOS capacitor in inversion. What we said was happening in the ideal case is as we are, if we change the voltage on the metal, we're going to change the charge in the metal, and that corresponds to a change in charge in the inversion layer. So if we're changing charge in the inversion layer, in this case we're um, I increase the voltage, uh, positive voltage on the metal, and so that increased the charge by this amount, dq prime. That means I increase the amount of negative charge at the semiconductor oxide interface by the same amount, dq prime. So where are those electrons coming from that created this additional charge here? Well, you could have minority carrier electrons in your p-type semiconductor diffuse in to the space charge region. That's one source that you could have. You could get this additional charge by just having thermal generation creating electron hole pairs uh, in this space charge region. And that's how you get uh, more electrons um, at the interface. But we learned about both these processes already. And we know that um, each of these two mechanisms has an associated rate with it, a generation rate. Um, there are uh, diffusion coefficients describing how, f how quickly the electrons can diffuse in. There's a thermal generation rate telling you how often um, these charges are being generated. So since there's rates associated with that, that means if I start changing my, my voltage on the metal infinitely quickly, uh, this charge cannot change that quickly. It, this charge cannot change infinitely quickly because it's going to take some time for either more electrons to diffuse in or for uh, a thermal generation event to occur. So if I make, if I change the voltage on my metal at a high enough frequency, the, the charge in the inversion layer is not going to be able to keep up. 